this is the plate to my scroll saw and first of all it's too thin and it sits down in a hole and so when you're running small pieces they get caught on the lip of the actual bed of the saw so I need one that's a little bit thicker and this hole is way too big so here's my current setup and you can see that well the wood catches as you go around so this needs to be a little higher and I think you can also see that this blade is nowhere near so there's a big old gap back here and there's giant gaps around here if you're trying to cut stuff so uh, first of all I'm going to bring this over I'm not going to make the circle in the center because that's not where my blade is I'm going to bring it way over here put a smaller circle and then just kind of like a small line out this way there's no reason for this to be anywhere near this big I'm going to make a new one this is a piece of steel that's actually just a little bit too thick so I'll have to uh, sand it down when I'm done. I'm just going to take this and scribe around it. This is the only metal bandsaw I have, so I'm going to cut it out on this. And I'm just going to kind of rough cut it and then I'll sand it to the line. I've started sanding it flat and I'm just taking a uh, this is a magnet out of an old well, this is a magnet out of an old speaker and if I stick it on there it'll hold it for me Jeez, while I sand it flat I do have to have some clearance around the blade because you know it flexes as you saw so but as you can see this is where the blade is set it's not over here in the center where you would expect it to be because it's cut into the uh, piece here a little bit but it is it's right in the middle so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna line that up and I'm gonna try to get right in the center like that All right, I am going to cut a 3 8 hole here, and I've got this kind of precariously mounted here. I think these blocks are going to hold it pretty good. I'm going to have to go kind of easy on it. Alright, so from this to this, I think this is going to work great. You can see my gaps are much smaller. I don't have to worry about pieces of wood falling down in there. And I think I've got enough clearance here for the blade. Time will tell. Anyway, 
hope this was interesting to you. Thank you for watching.